Hey guys, Tamp Zek here. Today I'm here with a video about the OnePlus 5 or OnePlus 4, whatever you think is going to be next. Because the latest one right now is the OnePlus 3T. Some are saying it's the OnePlus 4, OnePlus 5, something around those lines. But for this video, I'm going to go with the OnePlus 5. So obviously with OnePlus, they've made extremely extraordinary phones for quite a relatively cheap price. You have a phone that's around $400, £400 that provides specs better than most phones out there. Certainly better than um, Samsung, HTC, Sony, and I'd say even on par or better than Apple compared with the specs. Obviously not everything is to do with specs because some phones even with lower specs run better um, on certain phones, but even though that phone is extremely amazing. And the first OnePlus was very, very good too because it had an even lower price with even better specs. Obviously at the time, right now they'd be just average, but at the time they were also amazing. So what did they say about the OnePlus 5? So far we're looking at a Snapdragon 835 processor, 8 gigabytes of RAM, which is just astonishing, 64 gigabytes of internal storage, 4,000 milliamp hour battery, a 5.5 inch screen with a 2,560 megapixel by 1440 megapixel um, resolution. Those all make for amazing stats. The 8 gigabytes of RAM is huge. That is extremely future proof. Most phones won't even be using 8 gigabytes of RAM within the next, I don't know, 3, 4, 5 years. So it's amazing. Even the previous one, 6 gigabytes of RAM, barely any phones are using that apart from OnePlus. So around the back, there'll be a 23 megapixel camera, apparently and a dual lens setup, something that we've heard, um, or something that I've heard recently about previous links to the smartphone. So this phone is gonna be absolutely astonishing. If they keep it at a similar mid-range price, $350, $400, you'd be crazy not to buy it. Why would you buy an iPhone or a Samsung rather than this compared with the specs, especially if you like tech like me, you always get excited about, oh, how much RAM does this have? What's the processor? What's the milliamp hour battery? Not really how the phone looks. So yeah, if they go for the mid price range again, I definitely want that phone. So we've had confirmation the OnePlus 5 actually does exist and will probably be re released in the summer. So could be the end of summer where most things are released, you know, FIFA, new smartphones, iPhone even. So yeah, probably around September time, around $450 is the price. For specs like that, I don't even want to complain. iPhone is literally double that price for half the specs. So you definitely can't complain about that. So yeah, that's the video about the OnePlus 5. If you like the video, have any ideas, leave some ideas in the comments below or go to my Twitter. So if you like the video, please leave a like and subscribe.